Hi, welcome to Rotten Rebel. If you are brand new to my channel today, you gotta make sure to hit that subscribe and that notification bell and please do drop a like on this video. Thank you. So in this video, I am going to take a closer look at Initio's Addictive Vibration. So what does it smell like? Oof. Wow, florals, oh my. Uh, this one opens up in a floral way and it's a duo of apple blossom and orange blossom that leads the way. The apple blossom is very soft and to me the orange blossom is the stronger of the two, at least in the opening. I swear I get a slight hint, just a slight hint of tuberose and jasmine in this, but those two are not listed in the notes. So it's a very light kind of floral opening and it's really, really well blended. Within a minute or two, the whole thing transforms into a sweet floral as honey comes in. That soft floral mix gets covered by a dose of honey and this is where the real fun begins. The honey here is not of the heavy and super sweet kind, so don't worry about it being too heavy, but it is there and it smells gorgeous in the way it blends with the florals. This blend is joined by a dose of vanilla backed up by musk and at this point I'm in awe. The vanilla reminds me a bit of the vanilla found in other initial perfumes in that it truly feels luxurious and well made. It's like fine vanilla adding its magic to the blend while the musk adds that last touch to the blend making it a truly fantastic one. In a nutshell this is a sweet floral where the sweetness is that of a less intense kind of honey with a dose of vanilla and musk. It's incredibly well blended and quite balanced and I just love it. And oh, a few hours into the dry down, wow, magic. So how do I feel when I wear addictive vibration? I have perfumes that I love to put on, but that does not give me a unique kind of feeling. And I have perfumes that I love to put on that give me a completely unique kind of vibe. This is one of those. That light flora with the honey, the vanilla and the musk feels so luxurious and elegant with a hint of something seductive and sexy about it and that's exactly how I feel when I put it on. I feel like I'm spraying myself with something unique when I put this one on. So what about compliments and reactions from others? I honestly had no idea this would end up being such a head turner. I got stopped in the street by a woman who told me she loved the way I smelled. I had a guy in a bar tap me on my shoulder asking me what perfume I had on. And I had a date tell me she thought I smelled sexy as hell. This makes people react and the reactions I had so far are 100% positive. So what about the performance? The performance on my skin is good but not beast mode and I prefer like always to over spray a bit to make sure I get noticed. With about 8 to 10 sprays I get a really really nice projection that gets me noticed and the longevity is insanely good. It stays on my skin for a long time even after the projection starts to fade away. So when should you use this perfume? I really feel you can use it almost whenever, wherever. It's a sweet floral done in a delicate and fantastic way, so it's going to be insanely hard to offend anyone with it. Use it to the office when you're going on a date to formal events or simply whenever you want that floral beauty on you. So who should buy this fragrance? If you love sweet florals and if you love the scent of honey then you really need to try this one out. Just make sure you enjoy the scent of honey because this one has that in it. I feel this is as good for women as it is for men. I think it smells insanely attractive on a woman Woman, and I had only positive reactions so far when I had it on. So yeah, I think this is completely unisex. So how am I going to rate this fragrance? I gotta be honest, it was pretty much love at first sniff. And my first time with it on, I had dinner for friends and when they left, I ended up falling asleep on the couch. I woke up and I felt this insanely unique, addictive and intoxicating scent all around me and I could not figure out 
what it was. At first, I thought it was the scent of one of my friends, but then I remembered I had addictive vibration on and it was me. I just love it. It's a fantastic sweet florals. It gives me an amazing vibe and every time I use it, I end up getting some form of positive reaction, which is always a nice bonus. This right here gets a solid nine from me. It's almost a perfect rebel and I just love putting it on. And if you love sweet florals, then you pretty much owe it to yourself to try this one out. Please like this video, it really helps me out. Thank you. Don't forget to hit that subscribe and that notification button. Now, I would love to know if you have tried Addictive Vibration from Initio. Do you like it as much as I do? Comment and let me know and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.